you must be my patient. Hey there, my name is Dr. Bailey, and I'll be seeing you this evening. Um, for starters, what seems to be bothering you? What's the reason that you're here? Uh, okay, yeah. Well, I can totally uh, check on that for you. You come to the right place. Um, what I'm going to go ahead and do before we get started with anything is pop some gloves on to uh, uh, limit the uh, transfer of bacteria from me to you. You can never be too safe these days, right? Okay. And I'm going to want to do a general check. Uh, What I'll typically do is start by listening to your heart rate and your lungs. And then we'll just go around, since you're here for a annual checkup, and make sure that all our I's are dotted and our T's are crossed. So, uh, Really quickly, I just want to put my uh, finger on your pulse under your neck here and just get a quick listen. Uh, engage your heart rate. Is that okay? Okay, good deal. Okay. You just breathe normally for me and I'll begin counting. One, two, three, four, five. Well, your heart sounds good. Very strong heartbeat, very present, and your heart rate's right on uh, target for what it should be resting-wise. Um, so, what I'll do now is go ahead and pop in my stethoscope here and have you do some breathing for me so I can listen into your chest and your lungs as well as just hear your heart a little closer, okay? Sure thing. Okay, now I'm going to reach around back real quick and we're going to do the same thing. So, really quickly, just breathe in deeply through your nose. Now hold your breath and exhale. Good, good, good. And one more time, breathe in deeply through your nose. Go ahead and exhale for me. Good. Okay. Well, I have good news. Everything sounds as it should. No concerns at all uh, with your breathing or your heart. So that's good. That's a good start. Um, just a general question. You've been feeling okay lately? Okay. Good, good, good. All right. Well, um... Let's go ahead and get a quick look at your eyes, see how your pupils are responding. Um, once I introduce some light uh, stimuli, and uh, then we'll move on to another test, but I do want to check your eyes out. I've got a really small, reduced Snellen chart that we'll be looking at, and uh, I'll be shining some lights into your eyes. Hopefully that's okay with you, but it's going to help me get an idea of uh, your eye health. And then we can move on, check your ears. Uh, mouth, nose, all that good stuff, okay? Sure, okay. Okay, my 
friend. So I'm gonna get a little closer, okay? Use this little uh, ophthalmoscope to uh, look into your eyes and uh, you just follow my directions really easily, okay? It's a very, very easy test. So, just look at my finger or my ear, okay? Here we go. Get it without magnification now. Okay, good. Just keep looking here at this light now. Good. Look straight into my light. Straight into my light. Good. And keep looking into my light. Straight into my light. Good. Okay, that's very good. you see. Go ahead and reline four for me. I'll start covering your left eye here. And can you read this line that my finger is on right here? Okay. That's a good job. Good job. Can you read one line down for me? That line there. Can you read that? line here for me please left to right just read this line here left to right for me good okay and can you read this line this much smaller line down here okay same thing left to right as though your eyes are uh, responding wonderfully to the light and that you're able to see at least uh, somewhat near 2020. So I don't have any reasons to uh, recommend you to an optometrist, though I do want to do a couple more little tests, so bear with me. series of tests. I'm going to shine this little light here into your eyes, um, starting out from the um, right side, and they'll go to your left, but I just need you to tell me how many fingers I'm holding up, and uh, keep your head perfectly still. Don't look at my light. I'm going to be looking into your eyes a little closer, okay? So, how many fingers do you see here? Okay, how about now? Okay, how about now? And this side, how many fingers do you see? Good. How about now? Good. How about now? Three. Okay. How about now? Okay. Beautiful. Good work. And really quickly, I want to get very close to you, if that's okay. And I want to put this um, 
ophthalmoscope up closer to your pupil. See if I can't look at the overall general health of your optic nerve. And then we'll move on to another portion of the test. But you're okay with me getting a little closer into your personal space? Good. Okay. Good deal. I'm going to... Overall eye health looks very good. That was a nice pink, healthy uh, optic nerve. Exactly what we're looking for. The sclera looked very clean, the uh, retina and all that good stuff. So I don't see any issues there. Um, so now we'll go ahead and move on to your uh, checking out your mouth area. And what I'm gonna do is have you open your mouth. I'll take a look around uh, using my gloves, obviously. I'm pulling your cheek from side to side. Have you lift your tongue introduce some light into the mouth to see if I can see any issues and then we'll move on to another test. Pretty pretty easy stuff. So really quickly go ahead and say ah for me. Open up real wide. Ah good. And go ahead and lift your tongue to the roof of your mouth. see any issues with the mouth. Um, gums look very healthy. Tongue looks very healthy. And uh, your throat looks very healthy. So um, I don't think there's any issues there at all. Now, what I'd like to do is check your ears. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop a little sterile tip onto our ophthalmoscope here to check into your ear canal on both sides of your head, obviously, both ears, and then I'm going to perform a series of tests uh, in regards to your hearing and how well you can hear. So uh, we'll get started with this light portion and we'll move on to that. you to do is turn your head um, to the uh, left for me please. I'm going to go ahead and check your um, right ear and then um, we'll do the same thing on the other side. Does that sound good? Okay, good. Alright, so Now we can 
uh, have you turn your head the other direction and we'll check out your other ear okay and then we'll move on to our uh, hearing test sure go ahead and turn that head the other way for me thank you same thing on this side just bracing your head here to keep you from moving around too much good and looking into your left ear now looks free of any obstructions any debris any blockages to the ear canal the eardrum looks very healthy very no issues there. Exactly what we're looking for. Okay, good. All right, my friend. Well, whatever you've been doing to uh, keep the ears healthy, uh, keep doing it. They look very good. They're very clean, very healthy. So, good job again. Um, and now what we'll do is just perform a, a quick series of tests and you just need to repeat uh, the words that I say back to you just so I can see if your ears are uh, hearing okay so I'll say a word into your ear respectively just repeat back what I say and we'll move to the other side we'll go back and forth okay good starting with your left ear omelet omelet good rhinoceros Rhinoceros, good. Vacuum cleaner, vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaner, good, good. Award, award. Award, good. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Subscribe, good. Medical, good, good, good. Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. Wednesday, beautiful work, good job. Artificial, artificial, artificial. Artificial, good. Christmas, 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 Christmas. Christmas, good job. seems like you had no issue at all hearing there. Um, we're just going to get a little more quiet with the words, see if you can hear what I'm saying. Should be just as easy though. Um, and then we'll go from there. Starting again with your left ear. Skateboard. 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 Good job. no issues there. Uh, really quickly, I do want to test and see if both ears are hearing roughly the same at the same level. So um, just let me know when you can no longer hear um, my gloves uh, fluttering in your ears, okay? Good, okay, here we go. Good, and one more time. And one more time. your heart rate checked out with your breathing along with your eyes your eyesight your eye health we got your ears looked at um, and made sure that you could hear okay also checked out your mouth and in your throat to see if there was any issues and so far so good I want to get a quick feel of your face here and see if you have any soreness or anything like that around your brows cheekbones chin forehead area and even into your hairline uh, I want to 
once we do that test we'll move on to something else and then I uh, should be good to go so do you mind if I come in and just touch around your face okay good here we go uncomfortable when I touch on it, anything like that. Okay, good. Good news. All right. Wonderful. Last thing I want to do is take a quick look up your nose. Okay. Um, so go ahead and tilt your, your head up for me. I'm going to grab onto your nose with my thumb. Use our light source here to go ahead and check that out. So go ahead and lift your head up and checking into your nose here. fine. I don't really see anything that you should be concerned about in regards to your health. It is good that you came in for an annual checkup. I always recommend that for each of my patients. And um, it's always better to be safe than sorry. Getting these checkups really help to uh, alleviate any anxieties you can have about your your overall health. But I'm here to tell you that um, you're healthy as a horse. So uh, no issues at all. Um, but yeah, if there's anything else you need from me, uh, let me know. If not, then I'll send you on your way, and we'll see you next time. Okay, good to go. All right, my friend. Well, I appreciate you stopping in today, and I hope we can do this again sooner than later. Sure thing. All right, we'll take it easy. Bye now.